Let's talk about backing up your iPad. To get the data off your iPad, there's a couple of options that you could do. Option one is to click Settings. From there, on the left hand side, scroll down to iCloud. Make sure that you're logged into your iCloud account. And scroll down on the right hand side to backup. You may click the word backup now. This will back up all the data in your apps to your iCloud. Unless you pay for extra storage, you have five gigs that you can store of data on your iCloud account. Another option would be to back up to Google Drive. This is very convenient if you have lots of photos. So let's go ahead and hit the home key. Now we're going to go to our Google app. So click on Drive and when you click on Drive what you're going to see is a little plus button down in the lower right hand corner. Press the plus button, and now you're going to see the arrow that says Upload. When you click Upload, this will allow you to automatically go to your photos and videos, and that brings up your camera roll. You could literally select your camera roll and begin to select any pictures or video that you feel you want to upload to your Google Drive. Okay, let's look and see how we can get data out of an app. Let's go to the Notes app. What we're going to do is we're going to click on the little export icon. And now you're going to see that if I have this note that I want to take care of, I can print it. I can email it to myself. I could send it to OneNote if I turned OneNote on. Let's look at Microsoft Office. Fortunately with Microsoft Office, if you save things in Word, PowerPoint, or Excel in your Office suite, you really don't have anything to worry about because they will um, save to the OneDrive app. So you should be fine with that. The same thing is true with Google Slides, Sheets, and Docs. They'll save automatically into your Google Drive. Pages, Numbers, and Keynote, you're going to want to probably do some type of an upload for those guys. So you're going to want to, if you have a document in Pages, Numbers, and Keynote, you might want to select it and export it as well. Um, you can open it in another app, um, but you're going to definitely want to send the document somewhere else.